Zach Elwood has a divinical future. Your client squashed it. He needs to be held accountable. You want to take me to court counsel? You certainly know how to do it. But you will not be huffing and puffing me away. Please forgive me for thinking that, that I was a murderer. I suppose I was guilty of thinking the same thing of your client when all he did wrong was screw my wife. What are you talking about? What, what are, are you, you talking, talking about? about? The red-tailed hawks. Mr. Singer, were you in the park yesterday between 5 and 7 p.m.? Usually I am, but yesterday I was in my office working. And can any of your colleagues verify that? I'm sure they can. But about the hawks, and I want this on the official record, I would never exaggerate or fabricate a bird sighting. It's unthinkable. They're there, and I saw them first. Don't come any closer! Chad, put the bag down. I can kill everybody here! And I will kill you before you do. No! No! The U.S. Army is taking this man into custody. Please come with me. Where? Fort Detrick, sir. You want me to go to Fort Detrick? We need you, sir, please. I helped create this. You have to name it after me. Of course. Now hand me the bag so we can go on our way. John Schneider is an emergency. If we could get him, we could double the size of our congregation. Triple it. And who is that man who played Batman? Adam West. Adam West. Adam West has moved to the area, and I understand that he is actively seeking a new church. Batman is actively seeking a new church, Father. Wouldn't it be better to wait till the summer when no, the... No, no. If we wait until the summer, the Presbyterians might get Adam West. Plus, I understand that John Schneider does not like the heat. Yeah, I, you know, I heard that too. Yeah, I read about it in Us Weekly. Apparently, he sweats a lot. Are you here on business or pleasure? A little of both. How nice for you. And you? My business is pleasure. So, you were telling me about you not being married anymore? We grew apart. You're from Los Angeles? Yeah, remember, I don't like talking about me. Right. Maybe you saw me dancing on a table in Mexico. So, you were a stripper before you were a hooker? <laughs> I like to dance. Prove it. I recognize your tenor, Mr. Coho. You mean to imply that I killed her? I loved her. I cherished her. In fact, I think she rather got off on feeling punished. He seemed to enjoy hurting her, so it made for some very passionate ape-like sex. What if someone else were to turn up dead? Could I persuade you to get a bite with me, Shirley? You could not. Would it help if I had a pistol? Oh, dear. I bet if this were a movie, we'd have one of those ominous chords play right about now. You don't think I have feelings? Those things you said about me in court. I have feelings, Mr. Coho. I was just doing whatever I could to defend my client. It wasn't personal. It was very personal. 